Five tonight, a Franklin County man is using music to show people there is hope. It's his effort in the fight against opioid abuse and overdoses affecting families across the nation. News 4's Emily Pritchard reports from St. Clair. It starts with a desperate call for help. Someone you may know has been affected by this epidemic in one way or another. I know we won't never be able to change the past, but we can learn from it and affect the future. Then you hear Jake Thompson, whose stage name is Banks. One of my buddies, he had overdosed, I think, probably four times just this last summer. Thompson knows how opiates and addiction are plaguing communities like where he lives in Franklin County. That is why he wrote his song, Black Balloons. The title symbolizes people at vigils or memorials who release balloons. We can bring awareness to it and we can bring some sort of light to a dark area and try to bring some positivity out of it. Didn't think that this would ever happen, but I was way wrong. The paramedics saved me though before I was for real really gone. According to the Multi-County Narcotics and Violent Crime Enforcement Unit, which covers Franklin, Lincoln, and Washington counties, they responded to 24 overdoses so far in 2019. Six were fatal. Their spokesman says fewer people are dying now because of officers and the public using Narcan, which can revive a person who overdosed. Opiate overdoses in America are statistically at an all-time high. He wrote the song here at his home in St. Clair. It's only been released for a couple of weeks and it's already reached across the globe. Europe, um, Mexico, all over the United States. Thompson hopes even if his song just touches one person that it makes a difference. I just want everybody to know that you can do it. You can get over the addiction. You can get past any kind of roadblock you got in your way to be what you want to be in life. Reporting from St. Clair, Emily Pritchard, News 4.